What's up, YouTube? I am King Shank, so this is Droid's Finest, and I am playing Sproggywood. This is by Freehold Games. <clears throat> it's originally, I believe, 649. Hold on, let me check. I got a list of games. Yeah, so, it's originally $6.49, but I got it on sale for $1.29, because I've been hitting all the sales. Anyways, uh, this is a roguelike... Uh, turn-based action RPG, but it's extremely adorable. So let's get just get right into it. I gotta check this thing out. Oh man, let's do it. Uh, we'll go normal, I guess. I can probably change it when I want. Back from hell, everybody. There was a island called Clog, where clogheads chased sheep through the fog. They laughed on the double and never made trouble until they met Sproggy the Sprog, or Sproggy of Sprog. Talking sheep! <laughs> oh, oh my god, he's so adorable. Okay, look over here, a cloghead she sleeps. Okay. Mysterious stranger, so I see. Anyway, my work here is done. The rest is up to you. Thank you, Rahu! By the power you've granted me, I will save my realm. If you say so. Look, the clog head awakens. Away, away, before it sees you. Oh. Oh, God. Oh, this is adorable. Okay, so obviously, right off the bat, I need to move my face. Keep it in the center. Hey, you, with the pitchfork. Yeah, so, I kicked Satan's ass and came back. Funny thing is, I, I recorded Nihilumbra before I did, um, my Halloween Horror Fest. Or, before Slenderman took over. Anyways, that's enough about that. So this is literally my first time coming back, and it's already, like, November 6th, so... Yeah, yes, you, clockhead. Are you surprised to meet a talking sheep? Why don't you take a closer look? It's a sheep, and it's talking. I told you, now follow me. I want to show you something marvelous. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that's so cool. That's really cool. That's different. Every time I move, they move too, so... Wait. If I move, he's gonna hit me. Fuck. Oh no, yellow jelly. It's going to eat us. It's a box. It's a friggin' box jelly. I guess it's a box jellyfish? I don't know. We are doomed. It's hopeless, Clockhead. Let us lie down and accept our fates. Uh, wait, what? Pitchfork? Pokes things. Okay. That's nice to know. Okay. Can I attack him, please? Oh. I just need to press towards him to attack, too. Where's all the music? It has music. You were brave, Clockhead. You saved us from that deadly, adorable jelly. Yes, I did. Oh. He's a big jelly. Yikes! Another jelly! This one's twice as big and twice as cute! Oh, dear God! I leveled up. Good for me. Okay. I guess I can only unlock one at a time? Clockhead, you look wiser now. It's as if you learned something from experience of fight- from the experience of fighting those jellies. Take a look at your new power. Plant a bomb in adjacent space that explodes when enemy steps on it. Plant an extra bomb nearby. Plant two extra bombs. Use icon. Okay, cool. Powers cost stamina. And it looks like killing those jenny jellies gave you stamina stars. Okay. Good for me. Oh no, what's that? Don't touch it. I'm gonna touch it. On second thought, touch it. 
Ooh, I got a shovel. It shoots flames. I'm going to use that. Hoghead, take a look at your weapon. Shoots a pillar of flames. That's awesome. <laughs> okay, go back. How mighty you are. Behold, Cloghead, a true adventurer. Wait, Cloghead, if you walk up to that jelly, it'll bite you again. Can you outsmart it? If you wait a turn, it'll come to you. Tap the hourglass. No problem. <clears throat> Whoa. That was awesome. Yes, you outsmarted a jelly cube. And I thought it was... And you taught it a deadly lesson for being adorable. Fucking right I did. I hate adorable things. Look, this is what I want to show you. A mysterious door. Let's enter it heedlessly. No problem. Heedless it is. Awesome. I love this so far. <laughs> this is great. I wish the music was louder. I don't think there is music right now. I, mean, I hear sound effects, but no music. Look, Cloghead. We were transported to a wonderful place. The rivers are so blue. The forests are so green. But I must confess something. I, I fooled you. I am no sheep. No sheep at all. Ah! Hark, mortal. Oh god, it's Sproggy. I am Sproggy. Dark lord of this realm. Oh, you are just a cat with a weird nose. Begin your life anew as my thrall. For I am your master now. <laughs> you will spend the remainder of your days in my realm, Sprog. Toiling as it I see fit. Now, let us visit the meager peasant village where you will live. Okay. Oh, do I get to build stuff too? Oh, cool. So don't succumb to feelings of despair. I built this quaint farm and cottage for you. Lovely, aren't they? Now, my thrall, it is time to test your mettle. It is time to put you to work. For your first task, you must quell the uprising of Troublesome Jelly Lord. His name is Big Ick, and he lives at the bottom of a cave called Ikkilokolo. Ikkikolo, okay. Big Ick fancies himself something of a social philosopher. Lately he's been stirring up dissent among the jellies. Trying to convince them to organize into solid forms. No! I will not have it! You must go to put Icky, Icky Colo and... Uh, you must go to Icky Colo and put Big Ick in his place. Go to Icky... Okay, yes, I understand. Icky Colo. Icky Colo. Alright, let's go. I guess. Wait, how much time do I have? Eh. Oh, man, I didn't even press my timer. I'm an idiot. Well, uh, I don't know. I guess I'll just leave this as the intro, intro video. Yeah, go back, please. I'll leave this as the intro video and... Okay, so yeah, I can change whatever I want. Uh, the difficulty whenever I want to. Cool. But is there a save? I don't know if it automatically saves or... Uh, why is it on phone form? Whatever, bro. Fine. Alright, yeah, I'm gonna leave it here for now, and then I'm gonna be back with the second episode where we'll go to Ikikolo. Anyways, stay tuned, and I'll see you soon. Peace!